With almost 500 sessions at Next 2018, it's understandable that you couldn't get to them all. So if you didn't see best practices from Google SRE, how you can use them with GKE and Istio, then stay tuned because here's the rewind. When your critical cloud applications are up and running, you cannot afford downtime. And so you probably have many systems in place to prevent and monitor your apps, to find out when they aren't happy. Thankfully, things can get a little easier for you using a service mesh and standard reliability practices. OK, so what's a service mesh? A service mesh is a way to automate key functions of your network for interrelated applications. And to accomplish that, it's critical that this tooling be transparent and language agnostic, giving you increased flexibility instead of more integration headaches. Think of a service mesh as an open platform to manage how services interact and give you insight into how they depend on each other. It does all of this by adding a sidecar proxy, either a container or a little buddy for your VM that will handle inbound and outbound traffic, apply policies, and collect metrics. But don't worry, you don't need to build all this on your own. Istio is an open source service mesh that you can use for great monitoring right from the start, providing key metrics for observing the health of your services, like traffic, errors, and latency. Each key metric is useful to help you track if services outages are happening or where disruption might be occurring in your service mesh. With Istio, you get automated collection and dashboarding of traffic errors and latency right out of the box. You can export these logs into BigQuery, Stackdriver, or any third-party tool that you like and do precise analysis, alerting, and reporting. That way, you and your SREs can understand exactly what's happening in your system when there's an issue. Using Istio, you can also roll out new versions of a service carefully, deploying a canary test for analysis and measurement before you roll out to all traffic. This improves on basic Kubernetes functionality, which would split traffic across all pods evenly. But with Istio's tools, you can say, test this new pod with 1% of traffic without having to deploy exactly 100 pods. To hear more about reliability best practices, Dickerson's hierarchy of reliability needs, as well as SLOs, SLAs, and SLIs, check out the full talk at the Cloud YouTube channel. And don't forget to subscribe for more great Next Rewind content. Thanks for watching.